Good day. Welcome to Partaker's Friday Prayers on Friday the 8th of July 2011. Let's pray together. Father, as we commence, let our hearts and minds be right and still before you. May your everlasting mercy, grace and love be shown in hearing these petitions. We lift these dear people to you in need of a healing touch. For Elsie we pray for a full and speedy recovery after she broke her foot. For Maureen in hospital following a stroke. For Hannah who is having to spend time in hospital and enduring the pain of skin grafts. We pray also as she is getting very bored and fed up of being in there. Additionally we also lift her family before you as they are having to make adjustments without her. And for continued healing of Chris. Genevieve and Gladys. Father, we also lift before you all those facing challenging situations such as confinement at home, lack of employment, health issues and financial pressures. Hear the cries of their hearts and our hearts and give wisdom and courage to overcome and help the respective governments to send aid and be compassionate. We ask these things, our Father God, in the name of your Son, Jesus Christ, and in the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father God, we now lift before you all those who are preaching, leading, and participating in church services around the world this weekend. We ask that the Holy Spirit would guide their minds, and that the worship would be in spirit and in truth, and that the word, your Bible, is faithfully preached. For those in countries where to meet other Christians is illegal or not condoned by the government, we ask that you continue to strengthen, guide and uplift them. Let them know through your spirit, the spirit that lives within all believers, that we are praying for them. For the wider world, please do make your ways known upon earth, Lord God your saving power among all peoples. Renew your church in all nations, in holiness, and help us to serve you with joy. Guide the leaders of all nations that justice may prevail throughout the world. Let not the needy be forgotten, nor the hope of the poor be taken away. Make us instruments of your peace, and let your glory be over all the earth. Now there'll be a short time of prayer where you can give to God things that are on your own mind and heart. Let us continue praying in faith. Lord, in your mercy, hear these prayers of your children. Amen. As our final prayer together, let's pray the prayer that Jesus taught his disciples, what we call the Lord's Prayer. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our sins as we also have forgiven those who sin against us. And lead us not into temptation but deliver us from the evil one. Amen. Thanks for joining us on Partaker's Friday Prayers. If you would like to post a prayer request in the comments below, either giving your name or staying anonymous, we will pray for you. Thank you.